Welcome to Fox Tech. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to get iMessage in full screen on your iPad. If you've ever wanted a more immersive experience with your iMessages, this very quick tutorial will guide you through the steps to make that happen. Let's get started. First, open the iMessage app on your iPad. Navigate to the conversation you want to view in full screen. This could be from the column section where all your conversations are listed or from the pin section at the top if you have any conversations pinned. Once you've located the conversation, hold down on it until a menu pops up. This menu will give you several options, but the one you're looking for is open in new window. Tap on this option to open the conversation in a new window. Now that you have the conversation in a new window, you'll notice there are three dots at the top of this window. These three dots are key to maximizing your iMessage conversation. Tap on these three dots to open another menu. In this menu, you'll see an option that says full screen. Tap on this option and your iMessage conversation will expand to fill the entire screen of your iPad. This gives you a much larger and more focused view of your messages, which can be particularly useful if you're having a lengthy conversation or simply prefer a cleaner, distraction-free interface. To recap, getting iMessage in full screen on your iPad involves a few simple steps. Locate your conversation, hold down on it, select open a new window, tap the three dots at the top of the new window, and finally, choose the full screen option. This method not only enhances your viewing experience, but also makes it easier to manage your messages without the clutter of other conversations on the screen. It's a simple trick that can make a big difference in how you use iMessage on your iPad. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to Fox Tech for more tech tutorials and tips. Thanks for watching and see you guys later.